Hey guys, Teacher David here again from Guys With Games. Today I've got a super simple game for you to play with your students online in your socially distanced classroom environments. Now, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, make sure to do that because you don't want to be the last one to know about these awesome games we're sharing on the channel. And if you feel so inclined and want to help this video be discovered by other teachers, hit the like button as well while you're at it. All right, let's begin. Okay, so the name of this game is called Who Dat? <laughs> or Guess Who? I like to call it Who Dat though. This is a great opportunity to teach your students a lot of adjectives and also a lot of personal traits or things about someone's career as well. So what you're gonna do is choose a famous person that your students have definitely heard of and the student's gonna ask you 10 yes or no questions before they're even able to guess who that person is. So for example, uh, is this person very rich? Yes. Is this person a writer? No. These kinds of questions to try and figure out who you might be describing. I even like to play this game back and forth with my students. So after we play the first round, I'll choose a person and I'll let them choose a person as well. And now we're competing between each other and trying to figure out who that person has chosen and who I've chosen. Whoever guesses first, ding, 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 well, they win the game. So for example, they'll ask the first question and I'll say yes or no about my person. And then I'll ask the next question and they'll say yes or no about their person until we get to about five to 10 questions each. And then we can begin to kind of guess who the other person might have as their chosen celebrity. Real quick side note and tip. One time I was describing a person who I thought was just universally famous. I told them, a rapper from Canada, the number one artist in the world for the past 10 years. He used to play on a famous TV show in the United States and Canada. He's also the face of an NBA team. Who is this person? And my students just like, I have no idea. And I'm like, it's Drake. Obviously it's Drake. They're just like, who is Drake? And just like culturally, sometimes our famous people don't translate over to other cultures, even though we think they might. Another example would be if you're speaking to an American child, this person is a famous soccer player from Brazil. He was offered a position on Real Madrid when he was just 14 years old. He's one of the youngest and most popular soccer players in the world and one of the highest paid soccer players in the world. Who is he? Well, if you ask anyone who's interested in soccer, of course they're gonna know I'm talking about Neymar, but an American child, because soccer isn't so popular in our culture, might not know who Neymar is. So I try and stick to people that everyone's gonna know. Some examples of those people might be Mark Zuckerberg, Steve Jobs, uh, Bill Gates, Barack Obama, Donald Trump, and people along these lines, maybe JK Rowling, maybe Lady Gaga. These kinds of people are who I try and stick with. Even Michael Jackson, but that's again for your older generation. Anyone who's 10 and under might not know who Michael Jackson is. So in order to avoid this celebrity culture gap that we sometimes have, I will choose to have the student guess a career instead. So we're talking careers or jobs. I'll choose doctor maybe. And this is my secret career. So the student again still has to ask those 10 yes or no questions to try and figure out what the career is that I've got hidden behind my hand. So they'll say, uh, do I work inside? Yes. Uh, do I make a lot of money? Mm, in between. Uh, that's, a, that's not a yes or no answer, but I would say yes. Um, can I do this job without a degree? No. So they'll ask these questions and then hopefully they ask more specific questions as they start to kind of narrow down what you might be. It gets a little bit tougher. And then finally, they're going to start to guess nurse, doctor, etc. All right, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
please share this video on social media if you feel so inclined to help out the other teachers out there who are in the same boat as us teaching most of their classes online. Stay safe out there and see you next week.